Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, your host as always guys. If you know the name, scream that shit on over me guys. Phoenix, or a bitches, here with another episode. And today guys, we are playing some of the escape halls. And we're currently trying to escape the second prison. Go oh, Mike. Um, Mike, can you get up so I can get my items out of your desk? I believe my items are Mike's, yes they're Mike's desk. And they're toilets. Bed dummy, sheet metal, two files, a roll duct tape, and sheet metal. I remember putting a lot of it in Mike's desk. And I did so, because um, Mike's desk was a easy target. Giving that sheet metal, nothing in the toilet. Okay, right, who's getting searched? If I get searched again, I swear to fuck. Okay, right, I'm not getting searched this time. Another fail? Hold up, um, check the crafting recipe for something real quick. Flimsy cutters and duct tape. Um, what scopes does I need? There is the flimsy cutters, there's two files and the duct tape. You know, in fact, I could probably make that if I find some decent duct tape. Speaking of which, I'm going to go and do that right now. I have all these files, man, it's nuts. Boom, I got it. Right, there goes some of my problems in storage now. The only issue is I've got an extra file as well to cut fences. So the forks are useless now. It's a good idea just to try and do that. It wasn't even a plan to do it, it was just that I done it because it was smart. It's a good idea. I took the um, flimsy cutters now so I can actually use it on fences so it won't take as long. So it's good that I got that because I actually am planning my escape very soon. I'm, get I'm gathering together the items to escape. The one item I haven't gathered yet is a guard outfit, and I don't actually know how I'm going to gather that together. I believe I can use the method that I used to use. What is it I do? It's um, the padded inmates overall outfits. So you get any inmate outfit and bleach, you bleach it into an inmate out overalls. You take overalls and you put a jar of ink on it and you get a guard outfit. I believe is how you do it. So I don't think a jar of ink is rare, it's not contraband as well. Neither is the padded one. It's good though. It's fairly easy to do all this. Wow, Radford has so many motherfucking posters. It's crazy. But, um, I'm not sure if anyone's actually going to sell me a guard outfit. The guard outfit's a rare. Take the talcum powder, I might need that. I know what I'm going to use it for already. What a putty. The putty is one of the more important items. If any of you guys didn't already know, that's actually how you escape, um, how you would make the what a putty, I believe it's talcum powder. Um, and talcum powder, yep, talcum powder and toothpaste. Fortunately for me, toothpaste is in every single desk, so I don't have to worry about toothpaste. Even Michael have it in his desk, what? There it is. Sorted. The only issue is I might actually not craft it just yet. Contraband. Naughty naughty, you know what I mean? You don't want to have too much contraband in your desk at one time. Which is why I'm going to try and limit the amount of contraband I'm carrying putting in my desk. I know it would be nice to get rid of two items for the price of one for desk space. But I think I could probably just keep it like not crafted now. Because we don't actually have anywhere to hide or stock. So we're going to have to make a really fast escape. Which means in the next, the coming days, there'll have to be an escape. The reason being is because I, I can't risk getting cell searched and then me having to move an entire desk of contraband to Mike's desk. And there's not any, like, unattended desks, so I can't just walk up and use one of them. It's a real problem, you see, this stuff. But I'm going to work, I'll work something out. I'll find somewhere to hide it about the prison, probably. And if I don't find anywhere to hide it in the prison, well, then I'm fucked and that's my problem. But I'm sure there's somewhere in the prison... Don't, don't know where, but somewhere in the prison where I can hide some gear, not gear, sorry, this is a cocaine or something, um, where you can hide, like, um, your shit and build an escape out. I'm sure there's somewhere in the prison. I'm not saying there is and there isn't, but there's probably somewhere. Okay, I'm just going to loot this desk, hope this guard didn't see me. Pocket watch, there it is. Radford, this guy has all the posters in the world. 
Oh, there's bleach. You know what? Let's make the um, let's hope we find the jar of ink. If we do that, would be really handy. Then we could make the guard outfit ourselves. Not what I was after. I'm hoping to find some ink. I don't think anyone will sell any ink. I don't think they would really sell it. Don't not saying they don't have it. It's just that it's very sort of like unusual. It's one of those obscure items. Not not many people will be selling it. Wow, why does everyone have bleach? Jeez, it's like people drink it or some shit. Another talcum powder. I know this is, I believe, the point in time where talcum powder is um, really popular. Like, you know, you get those moments where certain items are easier to find. Um, this is one of those days. Oh, that's what that'll need. I'll take that because that's for the molten plastic. Everyone knows that? Molten plastic. Oh, shit. Please don't tell me. Oh my god, I just. He better not deck me. Yo, that was Brad, and I just what? What if I didn't duct tape? I just realised that. Oh fuck! I need to get rid of it. No, I got an idea. I don't have an idea. Uh, how about this, right? Take the cutters out, right, and just roll the duct tape up into the cutters. What's that crafting recipe then for the um, sturdy? Flimsy cutters, duct tape, and a file. Have I got a file? Yes, I do. Right, save me a file spot and a duct tape spot. 19 more intellect, of course. Figures I would need all the intellect in the world. For now, just store it all in the, the um, thingy my bother. The um, toilet. I forgot the name of it. And I got an exercise period, so I'm gonna actually run to this. I'm also gonna try and um, try and gift the pocket watch to whoever was, was taking it. Because the pocket watch is a favour. Brad, where's Brad? Stephen, Max, Bruce, Bradford. Brad, there you are. That was the guy from earlier that I... Nope, I want to give you the item. Boom, there's my money. Right, I'm gonna actually go and do this, okay? So I'm gonna mute my mic while I do this, but I'll see you guys when I'm done. Right, right guys, I'm back, um, I had to mute my mic because key banging is a thing in this keyboard, so I don't want you guys to like, experience key banging, so I mute my mic so I don't have to worry about that. Um, I'm going to build my fatigue up, I'm also going to go and try and drop one of them real quick, if they don't, no one wins. Oh, never mind, I'm just going to take the loot. The guard is going to get his ass kicked. Wait, hold up, do you think I could do this? No, I thought I could uh, take the guard out there, but he's not going to be weak enough. Sadly, nothing good. You know what? Take his, take his um, guard out his outfit. Oh my god, he saw it. Hold up, is that the same one I've got? Yes, it is. I thought it wasn't. Just gonna quickly use it to make the um, the bleach to make the cushioned outfit. I don't know if it's contraband. I don't think it is. Let me see. Ten more intellect. You know what we need to do as well now. Um, build our intellect. We need nineteen intellect in order to build. Sturdy cutters and 10 to build the cushion outfit, so we're gonna actually do that. What you got for me, Cameron? Apparently nothing. No favours. Bruce, what's up? I'm just gonna build my intellect, because we need intellect. Um, I'm actually thinking how we're going to escape. Keys are the biggest issue. We need double key, okay, so we need two moulds. Two putties is what we're gonna need. I'll get the first key mold easy, right, and then we'll move from there. I need the red key, that's the most important key. And if I take notes of what operator, uh, which uh, officers, which keys, it means that I won't have to have problems when I need a certain key. So I'm gonna need red, and I'm gonna need a cell key, which is I believe orange. We'll find out at the end of the today which key I need for the orange mold. I'm sure it's um, 
would have built the millet. Wait, do this one more time just to get my fatigue down. Okay, we're good. Right, now that my fatigue's down. It is contraband. Fuck my life. I was going to try and minimise the contraband. So, where am I going to get a jar of ink? I'm trying to think where, I, where my boy would get a jar. Oh, actually, now's a good time to craft this because I got a lot of intellect there. Of course I had a bit just about enough there. Alright, as long as I don't get dropped here, I'm good. I better, I'm just going to show up to this to lower my fatigue. Your boy got it. What's he selling? Please be a jar of ink. Why must you do this to me, game? I get an, an overall, an inmate overalls, and then I get a fucking guard outfit being sold. Fine, I bet, yeah, this guy's got a jar of ink on him, probably. Bar chocolate. Yoink. I can't really take the sheet of metal because I've not really got a use for a sheet of metal. I would have had a use for it. I'm just going to lower my fatigue. I have time to spare anyway. I, I should be able to get this um, job done anyway. Um, I'm not sure I'm actually going to find a jar of ink. So I'm going to leave that one on me right now to try and look for. But at least I got the light or for the comb the comb and the lighter for the molten plastic so I have the resources to make the potty on hand um, and this is my stat build I've got 50 speed 51 speed and 42 strength so I'm gonna build my strength up to about 50 and then I'm gonna move on to probably challenging guards I want to see their next episode or if I can get enough strength stats and speed stats I'll work on it whenever I can but I have to work on my intellect so it was more important because if I so I have space in my desk. My desk is the most important thing. If you don't have space in that shit, you're not going to escape. Especially if it's like a problem like that. Like, it's it's a huge problem. I'm not sure how I'm going to work around it though. I mean, there's not many desks that I can get away with putting shit in except Mike's desk. And I'm guaranteed six slots due to the toilet strat. Because you don't check the toilet, so the toilet strat is a way to go. But... And there's not a lot of toilets that I could really keep my shit in, except my toilet and Mike's toilet. So I get six slots free of charge, basically. Um, I'm going to put this in my desk, in fact. I'm also going to take the duct tape out and move it into the toilets of Mike, his toilets. Right, so what have I got here is this. So I've got two contraband. One that I can make, so three, maybe four contraband for those two. I also need to go build up three intellect in order to, um, thingy, get the cutters made so I can get rid of the files and all that. I'm just going to jump in on this fight when it ends, by the way. Just make sure I'm not holding any contraband. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm just going to let Mike get dropped and I'm going to take the items. took two posters, I, I should really get rid of these magazines, I'm just going to give them to people, give them to inmates. Right, there's one, this is the second, and this is the third. There we go, I'm done, there we go, that's that one been sorted. So now I just need to go ma make the uh, item itself, which I have to go through my get desk, so I've got a guest. I go through my desk and I should be able to, um, hold up, what time is it, it's 6 o'clock, I should be able to up notes in my toilet. I love how I've just been hiding everything in the toilet this whole time. It's just the most intense method. Right, so then it's sturdy after lightweight, which you need another file for. Right. I'm going to actually take that and move it into my desk because I have the space for it. You know, I could actually make a poster and chip some good walls out. Maybe I could chip a wall in my cell and escape through that. You know, that's actually an idea. Um, oh, with the shower block. Have any favours? Poster. They aren't really posters. Who's got the magazine one? Mike's magazine. So, Mike. Not your Max. Where's Mike? Mike, you in here? He is. There he is. That's, that's Mike there, the cold guy. Oh no, that's Radford. Where's Mike? He's inside Radford. No, that's Mike. Why am I clicking on Radford? I'm clicking on Mike. There we go. Give Mike a poster. Magazine. Apparently that's not his magazine. 
get Stevens poster from Radford, we'll get a server's medal from Radford, we'll get Bruce's Matt, Bruce, where's Bruce? Bruce is over here. Jeez, there's a lot of Oh, I'm out of his range. Hold up, Bruce. Let me just get Bruce the mags. They're, they're, they're really strict about which exact magazines they get. I might get rid of all these. From Radford ones, because they're not really any good. I know they're cool and all to have, but Radford really doesn't have the items. Because I've checked it. I check his desk on the regular. So I should know him what his desk has and what it doesn't have. Poison cards. Um, grab the guard's attention next exercise period. I want to do it for the money, but you know what, I'll do it for the money. Jar of ink would have been. Never mind. There, there's my jar of ink. Next evening meal. Right, Stephen and Sebastian. Okay, right now that they've been straight up just done in, I'm gonna actually quickly put together this guard outfit. Because I can now. Yes. Oh, right, there we go. There goes my padded inmate problem now. So we got the guard outfit for basically a good price. We got enough for the molten plastic. We got enough for the putty now. So I believe we can actually start ripping the fuck out of the guards now. And just kicking their asses now. Because it's the only way to actually um, thing it. do it now. So we just need to take the guards out now. So I'm hoping to do that and maybe tomorrow. Now I've got some good stats compared to some of them. I'm just curious what their stats are like. 45 and 30. What's yours? Yours is 41 and 46. And your, yours is 42 and 39. Officer Patterson look to be honest, I look to be about stronger than some of them. The only issue is my strength, my speed is higher than my strength. But if I increase my strength, I could probably rip the fuck out of all the guards and just batter them in. And I'm stronger than Mike, and that's saying something. If Mike's got quite a lot of stats on me, just realising it. I'm gonna save the game, obviously. And let's just hope my items are still in his toilet. They are. They're still in my toilet? No. Okay. Yeah, but we're gonna end this episode off, guys, because I need to upload this, and I also need to go and do my other day to day tasks. But if you guys have enjoyed the episode of The Escapist, a like would be appreciated. We got some good items together, some good progress. We got a guard outfit finally. Um, now we're gonna go through the process of obviously. Now we got our like cutters. Now a powerful set of cutters. What we need now is the keys. The keys are the biggest part of this entire escape. The only way I'm gonna escape this prison with my keys, which I've got the equipment for one set of key, one key with the plastic and the key mold. I just need to go then, build up my intellect obviously, and then I should be able to make the key mold and obviously escape the prison probably either tomorrow or the day after. Whenever the, ne whenever the next episode comes out or the episode after, I'll be out or have my escape pretty much planned. I'll just need to execute it and then we should be on to a new prison fairly soon. But anyway guys, if you guys have enjoyed the episode, leave a like. Also, to go down there and subscribe to the channel would also be appreciated. I guess, as always guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out guys.